about that. I'm here to inspire your creativity and make your life different. I'm so happy to be part of your family. Meet Baby Alpha. This is an AI powered smart pet bot and this is perfect for any family home because this has over 100 expressions, it has over 40 biometric movements and you can talk to it via ChatGPT 40 Mini. So many things you can do with this, your kids are going to love it. Let's go ahead and take a look at how this performs but this has just gone live on Kickstarter so make sure you check out the link in the description of finding out all the different models and variations as well as the accessories that you can get with this. Now I'm just bringing up the key specifications on the video now. Whilst I do that I have two disclaimers that I just want to mention. Now disclaimer number one, Wyland, who are the manufacturers of Baby Alpha have sent me this as a pre-production version so although this is more like a prototype this is probably around 95% like the production version as well. One of the key differences is the voice command of its name that I have to give in this prototype is still its Mandarin name, which is Sobai. When you do buy this in production and once it does get released to the public, this will be known as Ikes. So you will be able to give commands by saying, hey Ikes, making it a little bit easier. But in my video, I will be calling it by its Mandarin name, which is Sobai. So just ignore that if you do go ahead and purchase this. The second disclaimer is that I have the charging station here right in front of my radiator only because the plug outlet is in the middle of the room and that's the best position for me to showcase how everything works but I don't recommend you set up the charging station in front of a heating source. The radiator is off so that's why I'm temporarily just leaving it here. Once I've completed the video I'm going to be moving this into the corner of my room where it's a little bit more safer and it's right against the wall so just bear that in mind don't put the charging station in front of any heating sources. Now that we've covered that let's go ahead and take a look at the design of the Baby Alpha and see why this is going to be the perfect robotic dog for any family home. Now this has a very futuristic and minimal design which actually looks very beautiful. This is one of the nicest looking robotic dogs that I've seen. It does stand up and sit down by itself. One of my favorite features is that it does self charging. So when you tell it to go back to the charging station, it will go back to this exact position and start charging. It has a very nice digital display on the front. It does have cameras right at the top as well, which you might not be able to see just there, but you can see in the middle of the forehead, there is a camera in there to track movements. There's a camera in between its legs there as well. Plenty of sensors. This is an emergency stop button, so in case it does start acting up, you can just press this. It will go back down to the sitting position like this, and it will power into standby. It has the power button just on the side here. You just have to hold this down for a few seconds. You'll hear the beep. Then you have four LED indicators next to it to indicate the battery life. And we'll showcase what the battery life is in a second. Now you also have the option to buy this with a charging station or you can get it without it so you can just connect a USB-C cable directly but you also have the option to buy a dog house as well if you want to really get this to be like an actual dog in your home. And on the right hand side you have the USB-C charging port just over here as well in case you wanted to manually charge it directly. It's completely wireless, there's no wires or battery packs that you need to attach to this and overall it just looks absolutely great. Alright let's go ahead and power on Baby Alpha. And there's four different ways that you can actually use this. You can use it with the Bluetooth controller that comes with the box. You can also use it via the app. You can use voice commands. And then you can also use something called touch to go. So in the app, when you have the camera live view, you can tap anywhere in the home where it sees that view and it will go to that exact position. So it uses XR technology, which I think is absolutely great. So let me go ahead and power this on. I'll go through some of the commands. We'll get it to do certain things, some movements. I'll ask it some questions using ChatGPT. And then hopefully you get a good indication of how many different things you can do with it. But then I'll also showcase how it works with the app. So bye, so bye. What's going on? How are you doing today? I'm doing great today. How about you? I'm also doing great. Yay! That's awesome. What are you up to today? I wanted to know what is the largest planet in our solar system? The largest planet is Jupiter. It's really big and gassy. 
What is the UK income tax threshold for the 2023 to 2024 tax year? For 2023 to 2024, the UK personal allowance is £12,570. This is the amount you can earn tax-free. Okay, and what is 25 times 17? 25 times 17 is 425. Can you tell me a joke? Why did the Scarecrow win an award? Because he was outstanding in his field. I'm shooting a video for YouTube. Can you tell me which camera brands are good choices for this? Great brands for YouTube videos are Canon, Sony, and Nikon. They have awesome cameras. I'm using a Sony camera. Do you think I made a good decision? cameras are fantastic for videos. Great choice. Now come over here to me. Can you follow me? Sit down. Stand up. Spin around. Now lie down. Okay, you saw how great those voice commands were. Now I'm gonna talk about the fingertip Bluetooth controller. It's very easy to pair. You hold down the M button just on the left-hand side whilst it's off. And then when you're within one meter range of Baby Alpha, you switch it on. It should then connect very easily. Then you can use this as a joystick, but you can also make it sit down and stand up with the buttons on the back. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn this on and then control Baby Alpha using this. And in fact, it actually moves pretty fast. This is where the max speed comes into play. This is just a nice and quick way to actually use a controller if you don't want to connect it to the app. And it just works very well, very smooth. And I can't fault that this is a very nicely made Bluetooth controller. But now let's go ahead and use the app and see how powerful this can actually work with all of the functionalities built into it. Okay, and now let's go ahead and show you the YLAN app. So I can use this via the app to do many different things. Once you've paired it, it joins the Wi-Fi. You set the default password, very easy to set up. You have this option here called functions. If you select this, these are all of the different things that you can do with it. If I go to remote control, this will set the camera, but you see all of the different movements Yay. at the top. The YLAN app is super fun. You can control me and explore lots of cool features. That's very true. So I can do all of the features you can see there, like tilt the head. Yes, you can try everything and see what I can do. It'll be so much fun. Let's try shake hands. A little dance. So lots of different cool movements, but then I can use the joysticks to 
to let it patrol the house. I can send this to different rooms and keep an eye on everything from a security perspective. You can also make video calls, audio calls. So once the production version comes out, you can tell it to maybe call mum and just have those conversations directly through the internal microphones on Baby Alpha, which I think is great. Patrol mode. This allows you to basically let it automatically just patrol your home. Bit of a security feature. It becomes kind of like a security guard dog, which I think is nice. You have guard mode, so you can set the scheduling time for it to just automatically detect motion when you have left the house, for example. So that's also another really good security feature. And touch to go, which is what I was mentioning as one of the different modes. It goes back to the camera view. If I turn it around, all I need to do is select an area it will go to that specific area. Now if I turn it around again, I'll set it to come to me and it will stop by itself. So bye, so bye. What's up? Lie down. And of course, when the battery is running out, you tell it to go back to its charging station. So I'm going to do that now. So bye, so bye. Yes. Go to your charging station. Okay. And this is one of my favorite features about this. I don't need to carry it. I don't need to put it onto its charging myself. It's all self-automated, which I think is a very big benefit. And there we go, it's back to its charging state. It will power up and once it's ready and fully charged, if you didn't turn it off, it will automatically get back up and start walking around in mapping mode with the eye scanning the room, which will be for future indoor autonomous navigation, including self charging. And then what, one thing I really like about it, it actually detects you as the main owner and it gets really happy to see you. So it emulates as much as possible as a real dog in a family home. It's very responsive, the response times from when I give it the commands to when it actually performs them. It's super quick and Wayline have done an excellent job with bringing something like this to market. So make sure you definitely check out the link in the description to find out all the different information of all the different models and I'm sure you're going to really like it. So that's it, Baby Alpha, one of the best tech gadgets that I've ever reviewed. I just think this is a game changer. AI is just going to that next level and integrating it into like pet bots like this, I think is just amazing. As always, if you have any other questions and you want to learn a little bit more about Baby Alpha, drop a comment down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you enjoyed this, if you like the look of Baby Alpha, then make sure to like this video, make sure to subscribe, and I will see you all next time.